Hey guys, so I already did an intro to this, but I hated it. It was ass, so I'm redoing it. So I wanted to do a glow up slash get it ready with me for prom. So welcome ladies, gentlemen, and Steve Buscemi. So I really like how this video turned out. It's probably one of my favorite videos I've ever edited and posted and whatever the hell. So I hope you guys really enjoy it. And if you don't, you can eat my ass. life it just looks like i have light brown hair which is which is you know what i wanted because i feel like with my makeup done and everything it it look nice so at 10 20 today i have a spray tanning appointment and then at 12 i'm getting eyelash extensions i actually really like my eyelashes like i, I think they're super long like they're pretty long you know but I just want it so that for prom, I don't have to put falsies on because if I don't get fake eyelashes, then I'll put falsies on. And falsies are hella uncomfortable for me. Like I'm bad at putting them on. I'm ready to go. It's like 9.50 now. So this is my fit for the tanning. Like I have a bathing suit on underneath so that, cause I don't want to tan like, I don't want to spray tan naked. And then I have my hair up and flip flops for everything to be a lot easier. But yeah, let me kiss my dog goodbye, and then we go. So I'm at the place. I got here super early. Um, so it starts at 10.30, it's like 10.17. I mean 10.20. <gasps> so I'm not early, like I'm ready. Wow. All right, I'm gonna go now. It's 10.41, my appointment for my nails is 12, so I gotta make my way back quick but uh, there's a line my face looks rough because the spray tan just like clumps around your pimples which is great this is my line i realized i should have worn like a a bandeau type thing so i wouldn't have those lines in my dress but i think it'll be fine because my dress has straps anyways okay so i forgot to vlog because I got my eyelashes done. They look really nice, right? Right? <laughs> got my eyelashes done, but then I went to go eat and then I had work right after and I was rushing to get to work. But now I realize that I don't have makeup wipes, which is like a problem doing my makeup. And then I'm gonna see if I run into anything else I need. At Walgreens, I'm going to Walgreens. It's like 9-12. Um, I washed my hands and it went down the steam um, a little bit. So I was told to like scrub profusely that area. So we're gonna see if that works. So I took a shower. I still feel like I'm pretty tan. Okay, so now I'm gonna get my micellar water and clean my eyelash extensions. And there's like a teeth whitening thing. But I forgot where I put it, but I'm gonna find it. And yeah, so I took a shower. I washed my hair. I'm getting my hair done tomorrow at 11, but before getting my hair done, I am um, going to the gym. Why am I going to the gym the day of prom? I don't know. So I have these little spoolies. Um, I was gonna do my teeth whitening and the mask today, just so that there's less to do tomorrow. I also want to sleep. Fun fact, this is like the last footage I have of my belly button piercing because during my after prom, for some reason, 
the new jewelry I put in bothered it and it rejected when I came back home. So my piercing rejected, so I no longer have a belly button piercing. I'm gonna get it re-pierced in September after it's healed. It's healing pretty well, like my belly looks fine, it doesn't really have a scar. But this clip is just making me very sad because I miss my belly button piercing a lot. But don't get um, belly button jewelry from Amazon, just don't do that. There's some things that are just pestering. And I got my problem tomorrow, you know, like, you cannot be looking like that, you know? So the tooth whitening thing, I thought it was like a one and done type deal. It says that you can do, use the thing night and in the morning so that you can get like your desired effect. Oh, baby. I'll do it tonight and do it tomorrow morning. I don't know if this is clean. Oh, well, I already put it in my mouth. <laughs> this is like dirty. That's awkward. You know, like, I feel like that's a good amount. I got it like in there. I think that's way too much, but okay. I'm assuming it goes like this way. Mm. Mm. This is me trying to explain that you keep it in for five minutes. Maybe it's because the first thing, it says whitens in five minutes. It looked super white right after. I just rinsed my mouth like it said to all the directions. My teeth are exactly the same. No, I'm very tired. I'm gonna be going to sleep. When I wake up, these two boys better not be there or I'm gonna kill someone. But we're gonna go to the gym and then we're gonna probably do like a face mask, do the stupid tea thing again, get my hair done, do my makeup, you know, you know the vibes. What's up? So, I took a shower last night, so my hair is nice and clean. It's like pretty detangled, but like also, is it? Okay, so, I'm gonna go to the gym now and I'll keep you posted after. Okay, so I'm 100% overreacting in this clip. Um, I'm sorry, I got my period during the prom, so this is probably just me PMSing because I'm an Aquarius, sun and moon. I don't cry. I have no emotions. But for some reason, this really upset me because I really wanted nice hair for prom, like a cute little style. And this lady who cuts my mom's hair, who isn't really good at hairstyling but just cuts it, um, was willing to do it for cheap um so my mom recommended her even though i was just gonna get like a professional one that just does hairstyles for prom but i was like oh if it's cheap then like all right it should be fine so then i go but then she just kept complaining about my hair saying it was too curly and too dry and that she didn't think she was gonna be able to do the hairstyle even though i literally messaged her the hairstyle beforehand and a picture of my hair and she's done my hair before when i was little so she knows what my hair is like but then while i was there she was like oh i don't know if i can actually do this hairstyle like it's really complicated when literally it's just braids and then you curl it like uh. so i was getting very hostile because she literally took two and a half hours to do this and i it wasn't even that complicated of a hairstyle but whatever and i still don't have a ride but we're gonna figure that out i ended up just driving myself to prom but it's okay my car is sexy then i'm gonna go to prom and then have my after prom but since I have the pre-prom at 5, I want to start doing my makeup at like 2.45. So I have some time, so I'm going to get a bag and get my stuff for my after prom. And I'm also going to do the teeth thing again and also do a face mask. Um, let's see how this goes. <laughs> so I have this robe on so that I don't have to mess up my hair by changing. Okay, so I have my bag of stuff and then another bag of stuff for tonight. I have all of this stuff, so I'm ready and packed. Look at my dog looking so fresh and so clean, clean. Hi, baby. <laughs> Hi, baby. Literally the cutest dog in the world. Everyone can shut the fuck up now.
Okay. <laughs> so, yeah, I definitely have to recurl because some of my curls are already starting to look a little wonky, but that's okay. So now I'm gonna do the face mask and my teeth. Let me get the thing. It's horrible lighting. Let me get the thing. <laughs> So I especially want like my bottom ones to look super bright. Um, so we're gonna lather up even more on the bottom. Hello? Do you hear her like pitter pat? Hi, Mama. Hi. She's sitting next to me now. She's sitting next to the door. She does it all the time. I go to the bathroom or something and she just goes next to the door and I'm like, hi baby, what's up? And she like, it's just like, she just likes checking that everything's fine. Again, I keep this in for five minutes once more. This is literally me trying to figure out which face mask to use. Um, I had an avocado, an acne, and a coconut one. I thought the acne was gonna bother me too much. So I just wanted to choose between the avocado and the coconut. I'm pretty sure I chose the coconut one, but yeah, this is me putting on the face mask. I know this is very sexy. Try to control yourself and not get too aroused. Um, but yeah, hmm. I dropped my phone while recording. Eh. Anyways, this is me spitting out the teeth whitening, gunky, gross stuff, and also taking off my face mask so that I, now I can do my makeup. So, guys, it's the best part of the video when I do my makeup. You already know. And then before I start, let me put like a, a lip mask. I got primer. Just for prom, I got the Professional Primer, the mini one, because I'm cheap. And I got that one because everyone always talks about how good it is. And I just want to join in on the fun. It still hasn't like set in that today's prom, like I don't know, I'm getting ready, but I'm just more stressed than excited. Which like isn't good. So we have a tone adjusting primer. Can y'all? Yeah, so we're gonna use hello. We're gonna use that. This green guy. Because I get very red. And then we also have this poreless primer. I'm only gonna put a little bit because I already have a lot just to get in the areas that I need. I don't wanna do that trick, you know, when you put tape, like in Kylie Jenner's birthday video where she puts tape. I kinda wanna try that. Yeah, I think it was the orange. I'm pretty sure. It was the orange. Sorry if I look in the viewfinder because my mirror's over there. And then again, inner corner vibes. That's not the inner corner. <laughs> my crease. I'm putting it in my crease. Some brown never hurt. Darken it up a little bit. I was supposed to do my eyebrows first. Hello? Do you know who the fuck you're talking to? I don't think so. And now I'm gonna cut, like I'm gonna do a cut crease. Ah, oh, the tape's falling off. Bro, this tape sucks. I'm also gonna like pat it in because it's hard to get there, like get in there with the brush with my fake eyelashes. Now we get other brush. And we add sparkle. We're just gonna pat it 
into here. That's good enough, I guess. Now, this is mascara. Now, now it's eyeliner time. This is where everything goes wrong. Bro, with these eyelashes, like, I'm really... That's, like, fine. Like, why is it looking like that? I kind of got it now. Now, the other eye is where I have more of the issues. Does my eyeliner look good? I feel like I never do correct eyeliner for my eye shape. How do I take off the eyeliner with these fake eyelashes? How does one do that? You know what? I'm just going to stop touching him. This one could be pointier. <laughs> All right, eyebrows, eyebrows, eyebrows. Eyebrows are very important. I don't have those. Eyebrows is just not something I possess. My bad, I'm sorry. And then... I wanna make it look like bushy, you know? All right, now foundation. Now we get foundation to mix in because I am tanner now. Oh, that's like gray. All right. Okay. We're just, right now we're, we're mixing some darker foundations in with my lighter foundation to try to come up with a happy medium. I just want it to be like a good base for everything that's a good base that's a good base we're gonna take this guy I'm trying to get my zits and then now with the darker colors with the dark color and then we're gonna put it down my nose too even though I don't have like a fat nose like not necessarily but I have a big nose like this direction so we're gonna try to fix that I guess okay just found out that this powder I got has flashback okay because you wanna know why because like hopefully no one will take pictures of me with the flash and we're gonna use whatever's left of this guy even though it's not much left now let's put some blush Kinda look dirty. Like <laughs> now highlighter. It's like a liquidy one. <sighs> What's next? Okay. Why my lips? Okay. So I lined my lips. Now I use this. I like take the pigment from the line and like I guess raise it so it doesn't look like there's like a, just a line. I can do this little guy, make him even shinier. Now spray. <laughs> I 
Oh, I didn't carve out my contour. That's so nice, like to just carve it out. I'm gonna leave it for a little bit and then blend it out. Let me put on my jewelry. So, let's do my earrings. Oh, these look so nice, right? And I have this bracelet. I have this matching ring with my best friend. Put it on my middle finger. Um, I'm gonna switch back to my phone camera now. Okay, so now that my makeup's done, I have to blend this out. But now that my makeup's done. So for prom, I really wanted red and black ombre style heels and I was looking on Amazon for them. But all the styles that I knew would be comfortable and I knew that I really liked, the next available date for them to come to me would be in July. I don't know why. But this was the only style of red and black ombre heels that would get to me in time. And I knew that the pointy front and the shape of the shoe would be uncomfortable for me. But I was like, maybe it'll be okay, like I can get through it. But it just didn't end up working and I couldn't wear it, you guys. It was really sad, but I really like these shoes. Like, there's like a gap, you see? There's a gap between my foot and the back. I hate it. What's up, homies? So, I cannot walk in those shoes. I tried my hardest to like make it work. It's not working. I don't know, man. So, I'm gonna put on these silver shoes that I have because they're way more comfortable. And yeah, it's not there. Okay. I have my dress on. I have my seatbelt. I'm gonna try to drive to the first pre prom. I might not film that much for the rest of the night. I'll try to get some stuff in. But this was my glow up for prom. So now let me go. Wish me luck. I love you guys. Ah. Brian, Brian.